Kimba is the new uh, receptionist robot for the Strand reception. At King's we've had a receptionist robot for the last 15 years. That robot was initially installed in 2000. Slowly that robot has got older, tired, uh, and eventually wanted to be retired. So Kimba is, is the replacement, the new receptionist. Matthew and I decided to um, create a new one and also integrate the recent technology, be a showcase for research and teaching of the department and the faculty. Kimber will be installed in, in March this year at the front desk reception at the Strand, in the Strand building. So this is the main entrance to, to King's College. So compared to the old uh, receptionist robot, Kimber now has vision and it can hear. And that means that it can interact with people. It can speak to you and maybe it can tell you a joke. Hi, nice to meet you. How are you? Although Kimber at the moment um, has functionality limited to those things, uh, she will slowly uh, become more and more functional. We'll be able to maybe tell you where your meeting is, maybe recognize your visitors, maybe tell you uh, whether your train is going to be delayed on the way home. Kimber was developed by the, by the students at King's College in the informatics department. So initially this was done as part of the regular project studies for, for our undergraduate and master students. Uh, and later the King's College Robotics Society got involved and got excited with Kimber. And so different members of that society worked on different parts of Kimber. So for example, some people worked on the mouth, some people worked on the vision, some people worked on making Kimber tweets to Twitter. So um, it was a big team effort, basically, bringing, bringing all those different complicated parts together. Also the research students, like the PhD students, also take aboard, take a, aboard uh, Kimba and uh, refine the hardware and software further. We see Kimba is not finished, and um, we would like to actively encourage students at King's to get involved. The Faculty of Natural and Mathematical Sciences has recently set up the Wheatstone Innovation Lab, which is a place for students to define their own projects. So this could be used, for example, to build new hardware for Kimber, give Kimber arms so that it can actually hand you a, a leaflet, for example, when you walk in the door. Um, get, uh, upgrade the mechanisms and the electronics. So I think there's great sort of scope for people who are interested in robotics to, to get involved and define their own ideas. From the research point of view, uh, Kingba is a, actually a complicated system. Um, we also learn from students through their project. So although Kimba initially started as a, as a teaching project, a project for giving te students hands-on experience in, in building robots, um, we think that now that it has the, the basic capabilities, we can use it as a platform for experiments. So for example, how do people interact with a robot system? Um, how do we improve vision algorithms? How do we enable uh, the robot to naturally interact with, with people in the, in the strand reception. Uh, we can get enormous amounts of data uh, in terms of that and try to understand how the future of, of social robots might, um, might be.